What's up guys, welcome to new Unreal Engine 5 tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to pick up and move objects around. It's going to be a very easy video to follow so let's get started. But first, check out the link in the description to get our some Unreal Engine courses on Wayne Fox. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is go into our first uh, person character blueprint, which is over here. Now of course you can use whatever character blueprint you're using. So let's make that for example when we hold the E key we'll basically pick up the object that is basically in front of us. Let's so go ahead and find a nice space in the fence graph and then we can type key E and then go here and there we go. So the E key. So the first thing that I'm going to do is basically make a line trace by channel. This will basically launch like an invisible line or a right cast just in front of our uh, player to detect if there are any objects. So let's go ahead and get the first print camera that is where the uh, launches will basically start and we're gonna head and get the world location so this will be our starting point and then what we're going to do is get the rotation world rotation and then what we're going to do is access is forward vector so we can get basically in what direction and the camera is basically looking forward so now we can multiply the value and just right click and convert this into float by the distance that we'll be able to grab an object. So for example, let's put like 500. Now we'll go ahead and add these two vectors together. So just say control and then drag it into the one in the bottom. So it's a bit more organized. Let's plug in the get world location and this will give us the end location of our line trace. Great. So now what we're going to do is return value and make a branch. So we will only continue if we actually have detected an object. We'll go ahead and get an out hit and then break the hit result. This will basically give us all the uh, parameters of our uh, hit uh, hidden actor, basically. So the next thing that we're going to do is basically add a component into our character blueprint that will basically enable us to basically grab objects and move them around. So we're going to go up in here and type um, physics handle. Let's go ahead and press enter and we can basically leave it like that. So now what we can do is create a physics handle and then say grab component at location with rotation. So then we can use pass here the true. So the component is basically going to be our hit component. And then what we get to do is get its world location. And then we're going to plug it in and here. So right now this will basically be picking up an object that is basically in front of us. But the thing is that it will only do that one frame one, uh, once it's basically pressed. So still we will not be able to drag it around while we're holding the E key. So what we have to do is going to move this around a bit more. And the first thing we're going to do is move this a bit here and bring more space here. Because we're going to go ahead and create a new variable. This is going to be like is grabbing um, object. So, so what we're going to do is go after here and then after we have actually successfully detected an object and actually grabbed it, we're going to say that is grabbing the object is set to true. Now, when it's released, what we're going to do is make a branch and it's is grabbing an object. So if we are grabbing an object and we have stopped uh, holding the E key, we will get our physics handle and just say release component. So it would just release it. And there we go. And then at the end, we'll set is ground object to false. Great. So we have right now the um, grabbing system. So now the next thing that we have to do is go down and add an event tick. This will basically um, uh, get called on every frame. So what we're going to do is go ahead and make a branch and check if we are actually grabbing an object. So if we are currently grabbing an object, what we have to do is get the physics handle and then set the target the target location. And then this will be true. And then what we can do is to get the new location, we can just get what we did for the line trace, which is just creating a point just in front of our player's camera. So we can just go ahead and plug it in a new location. And that's pretty much it. We can just go ahead and set so all C and it's going to be the uh, object picked up. Boop. 
just to have things a uh, bit more organized basically now quickly one last thing is that have in mind that the objects they want to pick up needs to have simulated physics on and then in the collision presets uh, i have physics actor just to make sure that that's the ones that we want to basically pick up so now we can go ahead and compile and go ahead and press play and we can go ahead and go into an object and then hold the e key and you can see that we'll basically be able to go ahead and grab it and move it around and then if i stop holding the e key it will go ahead and just drop into the floor so that's pretty much it guys if you enjoyed the tutorial and found it helpful i really appreciate you like the video and subscribe to my channel i have lots of unreal engine 5 tutorials in this one so if you want to check them out go ahead check out the links in the description for awesome unreal engine courses and now yes with all said bye bye